Hello, anybody. I am Alpaca Patrol, and this is the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. That's right, I'm back with another episode of Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Yeah, we're going to play some Isaac, because, I don't know, I feel like it. Kind of felt like playing an Isaac run. Well, I mean, I can't play as Isaac, since I already unlocked Isaac. I guess I could play Maggie and go to the dark room, but that sounds, like, incredibly boring. How about Judas? Judas sounds pretty good. Now, I think... Yeah. Uh, the screen region looks good. I thought that there maybe was a little bit of an issue, but there is indeed not an issue, which is good. So how you guys doing? You guys having a you guys having a good day? Is it a good uh, good day of, of of Dota for you? I just say I kind of like replace some words with Dota sometimes. I don't know why exactly, but I just do it. It's just like a thing that's you know a part of my life. I don't have any bombs, which is a bit unfortunate. Also, this enemy sucks my butt. Have you guys been keeping up on the? Ooh, a dime. That's handy. Have you guys been keeping up on the... Oh, oh, okay, this is actually pretty good. Yeah, awesome. Have you guys been keeping up on the uh, the news uh, as far as... Well, there's a couple of news points. Um, I, I just sort of meant... Uh, when I first said that, I sort of meant, you know, the news regarding... Uh, you know, the Afterbirth update. The new uh, thing. The new, the new Isaac expansion that's coming out. Because there's some really interesting stuff in there. Uh, which is, you know what, I'm actually going to use the Book of Belial here. Um, because these guys can butt me up. And I don't want to get butted up, you know? That's like my main thing is to try not to get butted up. This actually gives me a little bit of extra bombs, which is nice. And perhaps I will use it... Well, actually, yeah, I will I will just use it here. I'll, I'll open up this, this chest. Make the room all stinky. Hmm, I was kind of hoping for a little bit better of a situation there, but we have enough money to go to the shop. I'm not picking up that blue heart because I want to go to the next floor. But yeah, there's uh, uh, all the updates on Afterbirth are actually pretty cool. I'm, I'm pretty pumped for the uh, Rebirth expansion. Um, unfortunately, we're not going to have a Book of Blile for this boss. Oh, we're fucking dead. We're so dead. There's no chance I survived this, actually. Um... Firstly, because I'm terrible against facing gurglings, and also because I don't have the Book of Belial, which is unfortunate since I used it on that one room. Um, I'm fucked here, I think. Okay, mm, dodge. Excellent dodge. Well dodged, Rob. Thank you, Rob. Um, now, hopefully I don't get fucking destroyed here, but I think I might. Um, as long as things don't go, like, terrible. I get it, you know, I gotta just find, like, the right strategy to deal with the gurglings. Because I don't really have one, per se, as of yet. Um, I guess, really, you're just not supposed to get up close and personal with them. But, you know, I always play better when I have low health. I don't know why that is. Maybe it's because, you know, I just have a natural desire to not screw it up. Um, anyway. Uh, but also, there was, uh, gameplay footage for, uh... The new Batman game, which is pretty exciting. Um, you know what? I'm gonna do this. Okay. Oh, I should just take this, huh? I don't remember what that does exactly, to be totally honest with you. But whatever, we'll take it. It's fine. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get a key, so we're not gonna go to the shop. Which is a bit of a bummer. Uh, now hopefully we can uh, successfully complete this floor without... Uh, having to worry. You know what? I'm actually gonna spend one coin in here just to see if there's anything that I can take out of it. And there isn't, so that's fine. Whatever. If I have a really dangerous room, I'll probably, uh... Oh, there's a key. So we can go to the shop now, which is handy. But yeah, the new... Oh, fuck yeah, that's awesome. Um, the new Batman trailer has come out. And it show It's the seven-minute trailer. I linked it on Twitter, so if you follow me on Twitter, you can, uh, you can find it there. Um... And, uh, it... It, uh, you know, this is actually a pretty good play, I think. Because they take damage anyway. But, uh, anyway, so, yeah, the... It shows extensive Batmobile movement. Which, I don't know if you guys are Batman fans. Um, if you've watched this series for a long time, you should know that I am, in fact, a, a big Batman fan. Especially of the Arkham series, because it has, uh, been pretty much always good. Um... Well, the ones that were made by Rocksteady, anyway. Okay, we gotta, gotta run to here, you fuck. You bastard. You bastard, you! But, um, yeah, the ones that were made by Rocksteady. Arkham Origins, I, I didn't get to play very much because it, it, it just, like, it fucked out a bit. I might actually go back and, and actually beat Arkham Origins since I never really got the chance to do that. Are there any X-Rocks that I missed? I don't think so. I didn't see any. Oh, God, I hate this room a lot. What, what am I fucking supposed to do?! Okay, so that's what the Swallowed Penny does, I've just learned. Okay, okay, okay. 
Where am I supposed to go? Just fucking go. Just go, Rob. Okay. That's that's fine-ish. Um, there is the treasure room over there, which I'm going to have to go back and get. But I think I'm going to do it after the boss so that I can kind of ensure a deal with the devil. Uh, hopefully. Because I could, I could very well take a great deal of damage in that room because it terrifies me. And it's bad on my heart. And frankly, my heart health is not the greatest. Uh, okay. I'll probably take the, um, mom's purse. Yeah. I'll take mom's purse. Um, I'm gonna leave the Bible, obviously. Uh, for now. Uh, well, no, just all together. I'm gonna just leave the Bible. The Bible's pretty bad. Uh, but also, well, it would allow me to get through that room pretty easily. But I think I'm going to fight this boss... Uh, which is a double monstro, so, you know, not that big of a deal, all things considered. Wow, did we take out, like, all their health with just that one explosive attack? That's pretty cool. I'm pretty excited about that. But, um, anyway. Um, yeah, I don't know what I was saying just now. Oh, go back and, yeah, and I'll go back and get the, uh, the blue heart later. Um, now, the question is, do I take flight or the nail? Or Yuppie's head? Um. Hmm. Flight's pretty useful. Uh. Hmm. The nail is pretty useful as well. Hmm. Hmm. I think I take the nail. For the sake of the health. I'm gonna take the nail. Gives me sort of a Book of belial -y type of deal there, which is alright. I could come into this room and- OH NO! I thought that there were rocks that I could get by, but there weren't! Oh, come on! I guess it's because we're too slow. That's a bummer. Alright, get back in there. I don't know what this is. I'm gonna take it, though. All stats up! Wow, that's good. Yeah, we got a, we got a health up, too. That's, uh, pretty fucking handy, all things considered. Now, hopefully I don't take damage here. I seem rather slow. What the fuck? What are you supposed to do there? Whatever, man. Fuck it. I don't like that room one bit, cause you you know what you know what that is. You have to sort of like go to that room on multiple runs to know exactly how you're supposed to do it, or you know be more intelligent of, as a person. But I'm neither of those like I'm, I'm not either of those things. You know, like I'm not intelligent as a person, and then also I haven't seen that room on multiple runs, right? So, you know, really, the game's kind of screwing me. It's it's unfortunate, you know. It's like uh, you know I'm 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 playing this game because of my my Twitch skill, my ability to uh, be amazing at video games, not so much my intelligence. Um, anyway, okay, uh, okay, that's uh, that is a possibility. That's not an X rock. You know what? Yes, I will. I will. I will do this. I'm gonna do it. Um, if you do it correctly, you can get all five every time. Mm, didn't work out that well. Unfortunate. Bad trip. Equally unfortunate. Explosive diarrhea. Not as unfortunate, but still not great. So, uh, yeah, life is not great right now. Um, I have to be careful here. Um, but I think I can outrange these guys for the most part, so I shouldn't have a major issue. Uh, but yeah. Anyway, the fucking Batmobile! It's so cool! It looks so cool. Uh, I was a little bit wary because of the, uh, the gameplay that they had showed previously was like, that looks kind of bad. But they did show it, you know, quite some time ago, like, you know, a year or more. And, uh, it looks like they have really, you know, gotten a lot farther with the design. On, uh, yeah, I'll use Justice. Um, they've gotten a lot farther on the design, and, uh, it looks fucking great. Um, the Batmobile, the, the, like, using the Batmobile seems amazing. It seems really fucking good. Uh, which I'm excited about, because I think, I think they knew that, you know, they, you have to make the Batmobile feel good. If it doesn't feel good, then it's not... You know, you don't get the, the full effect of really having the Batmobile. Um, I don't remember what that is, if I'm totally honest with you. Might as well take the Lucky Poop. Um, and I think it's bad. I think that's Cursed Eye. Huh. I'm pretty sure that's Cursed Eye. Hold on. I'm gonna Google it. I'm gonna Google it because I'm pure and utter scum. Uh, Cursed Eye, Isaac. Cursed... I, Isaac. I haven't seen Cursed Eye very often is the main issue uh, with the old 
Cursed Eye. As long as it's not Cursed Eye, then, um... Then we're good. That doesn't look like Cursed Eye. Okay, so let's take whatever this is. It's Lost Contact. Oh, Shield of Tears. Nice. Oh, I haven't had this in, like, a million years. This is gonna come in handy, especially on this room. So I'm pretty happy about that. Ooh, that was close. Luckily, we have a good fire rate, too, so there's, we're gonna make good use of the Shield of Tears as well. Alright. That's good. I'm a little bit of a scum. Oh! Um, well, it doesn't really matter, all things considered here. Um, Swallowed Penny, that also doesn't really matter. I think I'll keep the Petrified Poop. Yeah, I might as well use this, huh? Hmm, that's unfortunate, because uh, there was not a great deal that we could have done there. I mean, I guess we'll keep the stars. It saves a key on the next floor, so that's pretty handy. Um, intriguing. Very intriguing. If we get the ability to fly, then I'll definitely use that to my advantage. So hopefully we do get the ability to fly. Gotta be a little bit careful here because this room... I can always take, like, damage when I'm not paying attention because it seems easy. And it is easy, but, you know, there's also the possibility of it not being easy. I will trade a bomb for a key. It's a good trade considering I have lots of bombs, not a great deal of keys. Uh, we have the crappy squid arm, which is pretty good. Battery's also pretty good, actually. Um, hmm. Uh, severed squid arm, battery, oh, an X-Rock. Okay. That should work? Oh, God. That should work. It did work. Excellent. Okay, cool. Uh, what the hell? What the hell was that? Hold on. Some kind of noise just happened on my computer, and I don't know what it was. You heard it, too. I think... I don't know what just happened. Alright, fuck it. We're just going. I don't know. Uh, if my... If I... If I'm dead... Well, then you're probably never gonna see this video, so... Um... Goodbye? Anyone who does get to see it? Like, maybe maybe my mother will, like, upload this video posthumously. Ah, God! Oh, this is so fucked. Fuck it. We can do that without losing a blue heart. I, I, I'm, I'm fine with, uh, with making that trade, I think. I think health is, is, is premium right now. And when health is premium, I'd rather not fuck that up essentially um and we, we can we can do this without taking a blue heart of damage here i'm thinking oh baby i like it raw okay we're good as long as i don't get trapped in a corner like i did before we should be gucci gucci which is very similar to gucci um because we gucci main we gucci main we gucci main all right, let's go in here, and yeah, that's a good item. I'll take it. It's a damage up. Get three black hearts. I like everything about it. Um, now, the question is, do I take the battery, do I take the key, or do I take the um, the severed squid arm? I'm thinking I take the battery, honestly. Yeah. I mean, severed squid arm's pretty good, but I'm gonna I'm gonna take the battery, um, and then I'll well, just move on. I mean, I could take the key too. Yeah, you know, just for safety's sake, let's take the key and then peace out of this bitch. Oh well, I suppose we might as well go into that sacrifice room as well. Uh, but yeah, I have to fucking walk through this shit. All right, how about we do this? Drop this shit so I don't have to do this all over again for a third time, and then uh, and then walk down here. So that we don't have all this this trouble in my life. I don't. I don't. Yeah, duh, come on. Well, might as well fucking get the key, the, uh, the coin then. If I already fucked it up, took damage, lose another black heart here. But it was worth it. It's for Guppy's tail. And now I'm actually pretty glad that I took that uh, that key. Um, that's pretty good. Might as well go explore a bit here. Oh God. It's not like this room is like actually any danger to us at all. Considering uh, we have these shielded tears, um, 
mean, this shouldn't be a problem either, yeah. And... No keys. That's okay. We do have the butt bombs. Butt bombs are pretty nice. It'd be cool... It'd be cool if, like, uh... You're... Um... Yeah, I might have... Fuck it. Sure. Worth. Levels of worth were very high today. But, um... It'd be cool if the petrified poop... Like, if there was, like, an item that could randomly drop from poop. Like, a pedestal item. That would be pretty cool. I would be into that. Um, and then, you know, the petrified poop increases your chance of getting it. Or maybe you can't get it unless you have the petrified poop. That would... Mmm. Didn't want to do that. But, uh, it happened, I guess. So, whatever. I guess that's what happens when a golden chest spawns on top of you. But, uh... You know, whatever. Shit happens, I suppose. And, uh... And now we can get down to the next floor, which is pretty nice. Anyway, Batmobile! Fucking awesome looking. Like, it looks like it's a lot of fun to actually use, which I'm, I'm pretty happy about. Uh, because, like I said, if they if they did that improperly, like, if the Batmobile was not fun to use, then, uh, I mean, all this said, I haven't played with the Bat Batmobile yet, right? So, I mean, I don't necessarily know that it is actually going to be fun to play with. But from what they showed... It does appear to be fucking awesome. What what sort of makes it definitely awesome is that, um... Oh, that's fucked, man. Can I, can I move that with a bomb? Oh, that's so garbage. Oh, that is so garbage. Well, whatever. It happens. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Um, yeah, what, what, what they showed in the trailer, which I was happy about, is that, th like... A lot of the minor things that would stop you in something like, you know, GTA, that would just, like, you know, make your car just immediately stop as if there was some sort of, like, you know, impassable, like, god steel in it. Um, it seems like you could just straight up break that, which is cool. Uh, it's definitely fucking cool. Um, it also makes these little poop guys do things, like, maybe the poop guys could drop some shit for you. <laughs> drop some actual poop. I mean, you know what? I wouldn't even mind if it drops, like, literally the poop from poops if you have petrified poop. I, I would actually be alright with that. But, um, anyway. We're gonna have, uh, we're gonna have the nail for this boss fight, which is pretty nice, actually. Um, but anyway, yeah. So, uh, it's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, Hierophant. I will definitely use that immediately. There's kind of no downside as of right now to use that immediately. Um, but, um, yeah. Uh, we should be fine if we just stand here, right? Yeah, we have a fire rate that's good enough to block every shot that Gertie can swing at us, as long as he's not spawning any enemies. Um, well, he did now, so. Alright. But, um, yeah, that's pretty good. Speed up, size down. I wanted to speed up anyway, so that's fine. I don't know if I Krampus, sure. Man, we have, like, crazy mega awesome damage. Hopefully we can get... Oh, come on, that hit me? That's kind of nonsense. But, uh, anyway, hopefully we can, uh, get the lump of coal here. And not grab his head. Indeed we did. That's awesome. Uh, might as well use this. I can see forever. Handy! Anyway, as I said, yeah, Batmobile. It looks cool. All that good stuff. Uh, our tears aren't as big right now for some reason. I guess it's because of the lump of coal, huh? That's alright. But, um, yeah, so you can break shit. Now, my fear, which I'm sure it's gonna be, like, there's no, there's no chance that everything in the world is destructible. Fucking video games have been telling me that that is coming for, you know, since I was, like, a small boy, but no one's ever actually made it. Except for Minecraft, I guess. Uh, cause everything is literally destructible in that game. Not in a very exciting way, though, let's be honest. But, uh, anyway. So... Yeah, the... I'm sure not everything is destructible, but it looks like enough of the little, like... Sh like, as long as you don't fuck up, then... It, like, fuck up, like, really magnificently, you should be able to, uh... to get away with just driving freely in the Batmobile. Which I think is important, because the thing is... Like, if you're Batman... Batman doesn't fuck up, right? And that whole game... Is like you know, it's a it's a power uh, fantasy, right? It's it's you being Batman because we all know that you're not Batman. I'm talking to you specifically, Jerry. 
I hope there's at least one person named Jerry watching this so that it's like he, and I hope he's high as hell so he gets freaked the fuck out. Anyway, um, uh, and yes, Jerry, everyone knows you're high and they're all looking at you. But, uh, no, the, so, you know, it's a power fantasy, right? So you, you have to, um, you have to do it right. And if, if, like, if you do something where Batman looks kind of silly, then it's, it, then it's, it's gonna be shitty. It's not gonna feel good. It's, it's gonna take you, it's gonna, you know, kill your immersion. And, and that, like, that honestly is very important in those Batman games. And something that they've achieved, I think, very well is, you know, keeping that power fantasy going. Because you're always a badass. Oh, this is pretty handy. We just walk right into this room. Nice. Um, well, I mean, fuck it. A, a bomb for a dime is worth it. Oh, well, in the event that this was, in fact, a, uh, the, the thing that I think it is, yes, in fact it is, it is Haglaz, then uh, we didn't actually have to do that. But what's handy is we don't actually have to use any um, bombs here, which is nice. So I will take that. Um, I mean, I might as well take this, too. I'll take this, I'll take this, and then... Uh, We'll pop one of these bad boys in here and we'll be on our way, I guess. Um, oh yeah, I should use this, huh? Alright, so now we are at a great deal of health. We've got a great deal of damage. Uh, our fucking shielded tiers are awesome. The only thing that I want is, like, maybe fire rate and some more, um, like, flight. That would be the greatest part of my life. That would be the best part of waking up. It wouldn't even be Folgers in my cup. I mean, Folgers in my cup would be pretty nice too. I won't lie to you. You know, I, I could live with some Folgers in my cup. But um, if I don't get that Folgers in my cup, flight and a little bit of more fire rate would also, you know, suffice. Oh, there's an X Rock there. Handy. Um, we already got the. Um, yeah, we already got the small rock, so you know we're not we're not getting like way out ahead here on that front but um you know beyond that we're pretty good if i find i'll probably save haglaz until um oh gosh darn it um so we had to go to the chest with judas which is pretty nice all things considered so i'm pretty pumped about that go in here uh yeah sure Sure. Why not? What do I have got to lose? Even if I lose half a heart in here, I have another blue heart. Also, if I lose, you know, more than half a heart in here, also, who gives a shit? We're pretty good on health right now. We've, we've got functionally infinite health. We do have to fight Peep, though, which is a bit of a bummer. I don't like that very much. But I shouldn't have to worry about his, uh, stomps. We should only have to worry about his fucking eyeballs, which is what immediately hit me as I say that. Um, as long as I dodge the stomps, I should be good with the shielded tears. Because, like I said, our, our tear rate is actually already pretty good. Now, if I get some pills, that would be a bit handy, actually. Because then, uh, you know, we'd be able to, uh, fuck it. Alright, that was not worth it. Yeah, that was definitely not worth the keep. That's okay. I'm gonna keep Haglass, though. Um... I guess we'll just go to the next floor. Uh, oh, I could get the blue heart. That's, I'm lazy. I'm not going to do it. Watch watch us lose by one blue health. I'll be so mad, actually. Alright. So we're going to have two... Uh, Curse of the Labyrinth. Well, the good news is I'm going to have two chances at... Um, I'm gonna, I'm, uh, even though I'm only going to have one deal with the devil, I will have... Uh, two choices of... Oh, boy. Oh, of course, it hits me twice. Immediately. That is such butts, man. But, um... Anyway, uh... Yeah, we're gonna... Because we have the double... The double thing. The double didgeridoo, as it were. I say as it were a lot. I kind of like as it were. It's a good, uh... It's a good phrase. If I do say so myself. I'm gonna leave that there for now. I don't really care that much about it. Go up here, though. Mm. It's a bit shite. This is less shite, however. Getting a treasure room, Celtic Cross. It's alright. It's not like, you know, it's not gonna blow my pants off or anything. 
or blow me inside of my pants, which, you know, that'd be pretty nice too. Oh god. Oh god. I can- I will never learn about these brimstone fuckers. Never. Never in my life will I ever learn about this. Uh, ladder, pretty garbage. Both of those items are pretty garbage, so we might as well put all the money that we have into the, uh, donation machine. Hey! We can put exactly 666 in there. I should get a, uh, I should get some sort of a reward for getting 666 exactly. Ah, eh, sure. Might as well. We do have the 9 volt and the battery, so, I mean, we should have, like, the nail forever. Most of the time here. For the rest of this run. Um. Hmm, this is unfortunate. Sort of wish I had the nail here. It's okay, though. The extra damage is nothing to sneeze at, man. It's not like, you know, Book of Belial levels of extra damage, but, you know, it's extra damage nonetheless. Uh, we have gone to both treasure rooms, right? Or no, just the one. Yeah, just the one. We've gone to the treasure room and, uh, and a shop is what we have done. Um, even though I have the... Well, alright, fine. I was gonna say, even though I have the petrified poop, I'm not gonna, you know, open up all these poops, but... I suppose since there's this is like a terminus and we're gonna go all the way back towards the shop anyway, might as well get some more money on the way so that we can uh, pop it into the donation machine and hope for the best. Probably the last trip I'll make to the donation machine unless I find a uh, another thing or it breaks. Highly possible and likely that it will break. Eh, it hasn't broken yet, so let's open this up. Maybe we'll get a dime out of it. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Onwards we move, my friends. Onwards we move. And, um... I have enough keys right now for the chest. And I know it's a little bit premature to be thinking about the chest. But, uh, I do have Guppy's tail, so... It might be viable to consider being a little bit light on our key usage from this point forward. Oh, that was close. Because, um... Otherwise, you know... There's a chance low chance, but there's a chance that we could get, like, no more keys on the rest of this, you know, whole run. I say as I get another key! Uh, uh, fine. I'll use the nail for it. I think I was at full health, which is, I mean, it's a bit of a waste of the nail, but we get the extra damage, which is handy because I'm lazy and this fight takes 8 million years anyway. So I'd rather it take at least 4 million years instead, because... You know, every million years, it really, it really gets to you, man. Alright, some blue flies. Shoopin' of da whoopin'. Um, I'm gonna say no on that room for right now. Hopefully we don't have to go that way. This is an equally no-ish room because, uh, yeah, we're just gonna take damage here. I don't know if there's, like, really a great way to get through that without taking damage. <coughs> damage! Sorry, I'm, I'm, uh, haven't gone through puberty quite yet. Someday, though. Someday, my voice will no longer crack. That day, unfortunately, is not today. I was also scream singing earlier. I say scream singing, and that's sort of what I mean, because I was singing some Tenacious D. And when you sing that, you know, some Tenacious D songs, you kind of got to yell. You, you, you kind of do. If you guys have ever, you know, listened to Tenacious D, you know what I'm talking about. This guy is invulnerable. No, he's not invulnerable. Weird. I don't know how that elite works, to be honest with you. Okay, that was a close one. Oh, this is annoying. Yeah, we should be fine. Let's just duck and weave, get past this fella. Bust this dude up. Oh, there's another one. I didn't even see you. Where'd you come from, buddy? Buddy. All right. And you're dead. Um, yeah, sure. Oh, actually, you know what? This is a Haglaz room. I probably should have done it after I completed the room so I, yeah, I didn't have to deal with this shit. That's okay, though. Oh, the Joker! Hey, handy. We could use that on the Cathedral. Hey, are you guys gonna fucking fire or something? Oh my god. Taking all the damage here. That's alright. Should have definitely waited until, uh, until after the room was over so I could just leave and, you know, despawn these enemies, but... You know, man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. If, what, if that thing that that man has to do is, you know, fuck up the order of operations for Isaac. Because, really, if there was an order of operations for Isaac, that would... What I just did was not within the PEMDAS rule. 
of Isaac. It would be like... K-T-R... Um... T... K-T-R... T-U-H. K-T-R-T-U-H. Current... That would be, you know, that would be your rule. Uh, Joker, Tower, okay, well, yeah, obviously we're gonna take the Joker. Um, hopefully, I don't have to use it on this floor. If I do, then I do, you know, there's, there's not much that I can do about that. But, um, you know, hopefully I don't. Speed down, Rage is building. Uh, this is actually a pretty good item, usually. Although, if, if I'm being totally honest with you, I, I'm not entirely sure how it works. Um, but that's okay. Sometimes, you know, you don't necessarily need to know how an item works in order to use it effectively. You know what I mean? Well, no reason that I should really spend any amount of time dealing with that bullshit. I don't think I'll explore the rest of this floor. Uh, partly, again, due to the laziness, and also we're at... Uh, I didn't actually check the time because I didn't know where to look. Time's up here. We're at 28 minutes. So, yeah, we, uh, we can, we can just... We can just bomb... Oh, fuck. The bloat. Great. Oh, come on. I was standing at his spot. I was standing in his spot! That was the spot to go! Oh my god, I'm so bad, actually. Alright, I'm just gonna jump on this dude's face since I'm shielded. Yeah, there we go. There's the Taurus effect. Um, I think... I think left gives me... Uh, fire rate and right gives me damage? Okay, this one gives me fire rate, too. Yeah, both are fine. I'm fine with that. Blue Mom! That's a little bit annoying. That's okay, though. Not the biggest deal of the world. I went to pretty much every room on this floor. All the important ones, anyway. I mean, there could have been, like, a library or something, but, uh, I don't know. Sort of in the interest of time and sort of in the interest of, you know, my sanity, I'm gonna... Oh, yeah, that's sanity. I guess it breaks rocks and stuff. Oh, no, that's probably, uh, that's probably the nail. That'd be cool if Taurus broke rocks, though. When you went to Super Elite mode. Super Elite, you know, 420 no-scope gamers. Um, I can use a bit more damage. I, I can live with it. You know, if the game decided to give me some more damage, I wouldn't tell it no. Yeah, and we didn't get a deal with the devil, unfortunately. So, uh, we are going to have to use the Joker here. Uh, yes. And actually... Yeah, sure. Oh. Okay, well, that was lucky that we were actually still fast enough. Take both of those, piece it onto the next floor. We do have the, uh, the super shield now because of the Polaroid. Oh, we got Curse the Labyrinth on this one as well. Bit of a bummer, yeah, especially if I'm gonna get fucking gurglings immediately and then take damage. Especially in this room where you can't see the blood fucking trails, which is, you know, just, just, just skippy. Two bombs for three bombs. Good trade, but I also don't care, so... You know, I do have that working for me. Maybe against me. Who knows. Hey, hey. This fucking guy. Okay, chose the wrong path immediately. You kind of always got to go with left strat. That's that's kind of the, the strat that I've run my entire Isaac lifetime, is running left strat. Left strat is... Oh, okay. Luckily, I dodged that. Uh, I don't see any X-Rocks, but I'm also really bad at spotting them on the loom and beyond. So, you know, whatever. Oh, I have to get far away without damaging this guy, right? Yeah, that's the one. That's the ticket! Nope. I refuse you. I refuse you, sir! You're the regular, uh, Poop Master. Poop Master Prime. What's this guy's name again? I actually forgot. I haven't played this game in a while. Uh, have we seen uh, explosive diarrhea? That's okay. I suppose. Better than- Ah, no. I don't feel like it! Oh, Super Sloth. Intriguing. Oh, he's dead now. What's this? High glass. Yeah, I'll keep that over the other one. I mean, if there's a lot of rocks in a room, you know, there's a chance that we could get to a, uh, a basement type of situation. That would be handy. Uh, probably a big room is where I'm going to be looking mostly. Hmm, this is bad. Hmm. Oh, God. Okay, that was... 
I'm actually very lucky that I didn't take- What's with all the gurglings? The game must just know that I hate gurglings. That, that's, that's what's happening right now. The game knows. Uh, Pulse Worm. I don't think that does anything, actually. Like, it doesn't actually, like, increase your damage or anything. Um, but in the event that I'm wrong, I'll take it over uh, Petrified Poop. Don't really need it anymore. So, I mean, it's not that big a deal. Wow, that was really unlucky RNG there. Is what that was. That is a bit of a bummer. And also unlucky RNG that I have chosen the wrong path yet again. But that's okay. It's not that big of a deal. We will move onwards and upwards. Literally. We, like, we were actually moving up. We're going up in the world. To the east side. We got a deluxe apartment in the sky. You guys ever watch The Jeffersons? I actually really like The Jeffersons. If I'm being honest with you. It's a good show. It's actually a spin-off of... Oh, okay. I guess we'll murderify that guy. Oh, I should use this, huh? Okay, this is... This room scares the shit out of me. We're, I think we're about to take some damage here. Well, maybe not. Nope, yeah, we are. We did, in fact, take damage. <clears throat> god, can this game stop screwing me here with the, uh... Oh, god. It's like all the big rooms in the world today, for some reason. I don't know what's going on. This thing. Can you come here? Thank you. Alright. Give me the boss, please. If I say please, will it do it? Like, will it listen to me if I say please? I hope so. Hmm. Okay, we got one. Alright. Or are you? You're over here. Got him. Well, might as well go in here. Anarchist cookbook. That's unfortunate. The tower. Temperance. Neither of those are particularly interesting to me. This is slightly more interesting. Especially since it's a room in which, uh, it seems like I could break every rock without having to worry too much. Mainly because, um, there's none of those weird, you know, vulva-looking rocks. Unfortunately, no- oh, oh yeah, this is, a, this is an issue. I have a tissue. Oh, I've, I've painted myself into a corner, literally. Okay, now you can come over here. Now, we're gonna have two bosses here. We're gonna get this one Mr. Fred fellow right now, because he's, I think, the only womb boss that, uh... Oh, god damn it, these guys make fucking blood trails, I've just learned. That's alright. We're actually kind of... I'm, I'm a little bit afraid with our health situation right now. Um, I think we should be fine, but... There's a chance that we're not. I could roll all of my stats, but uh, I'm going to say no on that. I'll take the tears and shot speed up, please and thank you. And uh, yeah, I guess we'll just go fight. It lives. This will be a little bit of annoying of a fight because of this garbage. Since our shots are going to go away if they hit the tears. But after we get past the first phase, now it is like kind of impossible to lose on this fight. Oh, except for when this shit happens. Although it's doing quite a bit of damage, so I suppose I shouldn't complain. Eh, except immediately afterwards when I take damage because uh, I don't know when it's stopping. And we succeeded. Good. We unlocked Shadow Baby! We did it. I mean, we, we technically did all that we needed to do to unlock the thing that we needed on this floor. I'm starting to regret my decision of taking the, uh, the wealth contract. I know, I already knew it was, like, unnecessary, but, um... You know, we haven't been able to retain our health very well, it seems. Despite everything. Oh, we could... Okay, that's kind of handy. Um, gotta be careful. I don't want to unlock uh, the fucking cellar. I don't think it... I don't think you can do it on, uh, on these guys. I should open up this thing just in case. Yeah, okay. Come on. You can give me... You can give me the thing. Eh, you didn't give me the thing. I would have liked the thing, I won't lie to you. If the game decided to give me the thing, I would have I would have taken the thing that I would have liked. Very much. I don't, you know what? I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't remember what thing I was talking about. Um, was it the boss? Maybe it was the boss. I don't know. I don't know what I'm... I really don't even listen to myself most of the time when I say things. So... Frankly, I don't understand why you guys listen to me at all. Because, I mean, there's 
not a, a great deal to be gained, if I'm being totally honest with you. Right, we're again back at four health. I mean, even if we do end up in the boss room with four health, tears up, that's good. I would have liked that a little bit earlier in the run, but you know, hey, beggars can't be choosers. Another Hierophant would be nice. This room is fucking garbage. Garbage town population me. Mm, come on! Alright, whatever. Alright, we have the boss. Uh, which we should be able to complete, I think, pretty simply. Um, now the question is, do I do one more room so that I can get the nail? I think I do. I think I do it. I think I'm gonna do-do it. Uh, hopefully I don't take damage here. Uh, I should be fine. Should be, I say. You know, there's always a chance that, like, some stray so shot that he shoots at, like, 5 million miles per hour and is impossible to dodge. Or, like, weird perspective shots like that one. But that didn't happen. Justice. Yeah, sure. There's another key. Couldn't hurt. Hey, we actually have 11 keys, so as long as we can complete this, uh... This boss, we should be good to go, I think. On the next floor. As long as we get some, some good items or something, you know? That, uh, that is depending upon that entirely. Oh, come on! That hit me. You're a nonsense maker is what you are. Alright. Fire rate's still pretty good. I right, gotta do this again. Oh, shit! I don't know how long that lasts, man. I really wish they didn't change the freaking music on that like they did in this game instead of uh, what it was at the old, olden style game. Uh, because, like, in that version, I knew when, like, when my time was running out. Like, every time, consistently, I knew because of the music cue. But I don't really know in this game when my time runs out. Oh, this is a little bit dangerous. Okay, luckily the RNG didn't fuck me there. Sometimes it does when you're standing in that corner. Uh-oh. Oof, close one. Our speed is not the greatest, especially when we use the nail. But we succeeded. So we can move on to the chest and hopefully complete it? I don't know, our health is not looking fantastic right now. Um, hopefully we get some good stuff here. Spider butt, Lazarus rags. Spider bite, slow effect, Lazarus rags. I don't know. Pisces. Whoa! Spider bite doing its work, it looks like, and then also other shit that's happening. I will never learn what the zodiac signs do, I'm gonna be honest with you. That, that day is just never gonna come for me. Oh, and this, this thing again. See, I don't know when it. Okay, there it's running out. Running out. We've learned. I've learned. I'm learning. I'm learning how to deal with the Taurus demon. Alright, some hearts that I will not use. Gonna still stick on the old, uh. The old nail, because that does give us our health as long as we can achieve it. Two things common cold, toothy tooth shot. I like it too. Both of those are pretty good. Should be fine in this room as long as I can spot the spiders. Play an old game of spot the spiders. Hmm. Probably should have... Ah, no. I don't, I don't actually want the health up, I think. Even though I sort of do, I also don't. Because if I get the health up, then um, I would lose the Polaroid effect, which... Honestly, I think is is definitely going to be something that might keep me alive on this run. Although, right now, I'm feeling pretty gosh darn strong. Two of clubs, those are bombs. Doesn't really matter. Um, I suppose I should be using... Yeah, fuck it, I'll just use a bunch of bombs here. Since I don't know what's happening anymore. Like, I, I could get fucked on this room, I think. Okay, we're good. Oh, no, we're not. Fuck, I can't believe I immediately took damage there. Oh, okay, and there's... That shit, which is working for us, but when is it running out? Okay, now it's run out. Man, I really wish they hadn't changed the music on that. It's so hard to tell. I mean, because you have to watch the visual cue, but you don't always get the visual cue. Alright, looks like we're we're fighting this boss. I mean, hopefully we can succeed. I'll just have to play my heart out right now. 
to do so. Shouldn't be a major issue. I mean, last time when I fought Isaac, I wasn't really dodging so much because, I don't know, I was mostly kind of lazy. Oh, we have this again. As long as I don't fuck this up and I don't leave when I need to. Okay, like right now. Now is when I need to leave. Okay, we have not taken damage. Oh my god, why is he spawning so many fucking flies? I've never seen him spawn this many flies before. Did they change this boss? Maybe they didn't. Maybe I'm just, like, a nerd and also, you know, haven't played the game in a while, which is, in fact, the case. But it's very hard to get these shots in. I should be using bombs, though. For sure. Definitely if I could hit him with them as well. It's definitely what I want to do. I just have to be a little bit careful because I don't want to hit myself with the bomb. Mm, this is... Okay, that was a little bit of a dangerous strat that I just pulled there. Hit him with the bomb. Deal the extra poison damage. Took some damage where I almost took some... I should have taken damage, let's be honest here. And we'll get him with that. That shouldn't do him in. Good! We completed it! Nice! That was a little bit dangerous there at the end, but I think we did get carried by the chest item, so I'm, you know, I'm, I'm pretty alright with that. That, uh, that went pretty well. You know, a successful run. We haven't had a, an Isaac run on the channel in a while. We haven't had a successful Isaac run on the channel in a while, for that matter. But, uh, yeah, you know, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. This has been Isaac Binding, Binding about... I being a diamond, you can eat it. As a community, we're going to see it. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, anybody. Uh, <coughs> I'm dying. <coughs> oh, actually, though. Uh, God, why is that always so loud? Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, more stuff on the channel soon. Anyway, I love you all, you beautiful people. Thanks for watching. This is Alpaca Patrol signing out. Peace, fools.